Okay, survivors. Welcome to a great location and a great map so far, anyway. The gold mine in the Ash Canyon region of Great Bear Island in the long dark. I have a feeling this is going to be this? This great. But we don't have any lantern fuel. So we're going to have to use torches. I better take this food. To get, ooh, what's this? Nice. Yeah, we've been starved for knowledge. Uh, I'll take that and we'll see what's up. And all of a sudden we're getting a bunch. We have guns, guns, guns. We have... Do I want this? Maybe. Uh, wilderness kitchen. We just found. Oh, this is water. Cold water! <laughs> yeah, perhaps I should have been more careful. Oh, I can't get over this. I should have took my boots off. And socks. Yeah, we found wilderness kitchen guns, 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 and we just found the field dressing guide. So, yeah, suddenly we're swimming in knowledge, and that's great, because our skills aren't doing super good. I think our rifle skill is pretty good. And having a good time with the guns in this game, I don't know why. I usually don't do that. What is this place? Look where? Do we have to go over the water again? Wet feet. Wow, you're like a cat. You don't like wet feet, Mr. McKenzie. I mean, I don't blame you. In a cold weather survival situation, we're wet. I need to find some place to escape this cold. Wet is not good. It's all this. What's over here? What the heck? Sound like a probably the basket or yeah. Can't do anything with it. Nope. Oh, we're about to use this torch. kind of cool. Uh, I don't know what it does. I'm sure it has good use down here. Or up here. It's like we went into this mine and then we went uphill. Could end up being useful. Couple rifle cartridges. You got nothing else on here? What happened to you? What is all this? Oh. Right. Oh. Bow down before it. I don't, I don't want to go near it. I'm so, I'm so excited I could probably puke on it. I can always use more food. That is everything. That's the whole reason we're here, that backpack. And these, oh yeah. Crampons, traction for your feet. 
rope climbing journeys are less stamina, sprints are sprains are less frequent, and you can travel with more confidence over weak ice. Nice. And we wear them as uh, an accessory, right? Yeah. Full passion parka. Charcoal, sardine. I can barely oh, walk with this much gear. Cigar. Oh yeah, I can do something about that. We've got you covered, Mr. McKenzie. Uh, is there anything over here? Oh, this is where we were just looking. Just came up over there. Something's making me oh, feel tired. Crap! Look at that. Should check the percentage. Uh, don't really need the fire alert. Technical backpack. Technical backpack. I've never been so hungry in my life. Oh, we are pretty hungry, huh? Celebratory fire. Wow, I have a lot of matches. Technical backpack. So the technical backpack is going to give us 11 extra pounds of carry weight. So if we're well fed, that's 11 extra pounds. Technical backpack gives us 11 pounds on top of that. And then... Turned out pretty well. The... Moosehide Satchel is going to give us... Another 11 pounds. Or... A carry weight of 99 pounds. That sounds... Very much worth it. To me. I don't think we have anything to cook, really. Do I have any, uh... I don't have an empty can. Do I have any teas on me, or... even prepared? So, no page. Glad I had my good pack with me on this trip. Some chest pain on the trek past the high falls, but I expected that after the last surgery. Just going to hunker down in here until the storm passes. Tomorrow, I point at Wolf's Jaw. That's where we just were. And then head for home. Well, I have a feeling you didn't make it. Look at it in all its glory. You steer to your backpack with all the bells and whistles. You can carry more gear before becoming encumbered. Let's take it. So now we have plus 22, but we have 105, 105 pounds of gear on us. It's hilarious. What time of day is it? It's still dark. We have to get some sleep. Yeah, we have to get some sleep, but I, I want to re get some of this weight off of us and read one of these books. So even though we didn't find one single speck of gold in this mine, it was absolutely a gold mine. Uh, there's so much good stuff in here. Like, we have to remember that this is here somehow. And this too, the revolver, for sure. Uh, the hatchet we don't need, we might need the other torch. The... I didn't repair our clothes, so we're only at 38 degrees. Our 
We lost our well fed bonus, so we can only carry 77 pounds right now. It should be 88. So I ate a whole bunch. I slept a whole bunch. We had the crampons on. I think I have to eat something else. Get us right to the top. I have a couple teas that I can uh, drink up, and that gives you a little bit of calories, but not too much. And this is the only torch I have. The, the thing is, we have so many flares. I just hate using them unless I have to. If I can get them to a safe spot and store them, they're like gold. They don't degrade very fast at all. But it's almost, it's gonna be midday soon. Hopefully the weather's not too bad outside. I have a feeling getting out of this area is not going to be easy. Especially if I keep Picking stuff up in without keeping myself well fed. That's an extra 11 pounds that we don't have right now. Alright, this torch is going out. That's unfortunate. But I think we'll be okay. I don't have any coffee on me that's cooked either. just got the crap. I think once we go down here we can't get back up. So I just want to make sure we don't what's that? One random matches. Look how random that is. the entrance yeah we found a lot of stuff there just before you even get into the mine out by the entrance was a dead guy with a revolver and then in the mine by that big crate thing was another hunting rifle so that right there makes it worth it oh Yeah, we need to shed some weight. We're going to get sprained real bad. And we're not going to be able to climb down this rope. Without our well-fed bonus. I just, I forgot to eat before I slept. Oh, there's another rope. Okay. So the rope we went down by the, uh weird mining gear like the, the wooden wheel on it and stuff there's another rope down yeah this will lead right back to that if we ever need to come back that's kind of a shortcut we could have came we could have just ran right down here but we would have missed like all the awesome stuff the backpack and whatnot okay so how are we going to get down this rope drop something significant. Is that a backpack right there? I 
just don't want to carry it, but I want to stay well fed. Because obviously I can't stop picking stuff up. That'll come in handy. Uh, actually, can I use that? No. Okay, so why we still have the stamina bonus? I think we're gonna have to. What's all this? Just take the song tip for now. But while we have the stamina bonus, we need to keep moving. What is down here? The moose, you see him? So early in the day. this nice uh do we have to re reload that no nope. how about this guy So, what should I do? I can go down this rope and drop a bunch of stuff and shoot them. I could possibly... I think I can shoot them from here. But then there's going to be one pissed off moose down there. We're not going to be able to see him. But I did hit him and he will probably bleed out, hopefully. But he's just going to constantly be right underneath us. He's tracking us right now. So, oh, did I not? Where the hell was I when I fired that shot? I don't think I want to hang out and eat moose. I have a, a, a whole moose hide waiting. Back at Black Rock. <sighs> convenient, he's right at the bottom of the rope. What if he's just napping?
it's like early afternoon. Um, but we'll take an hour's worth, I guess. I probably won't need the gut at all. I'm gonna have to leave something behind. We are gonna be heavy, and we are gonna be... Surrounded by wolves, probably. And I'm not too familiar with this area, and it's super foggy. So we're just gonna have to keep our ears peeled. Is this perk? Uh, I thought it was perk. Please be it. This is cave. Oh hell yeah. Yeah, it's starting to get dark soon. It's starting to get dark soon too. There's a ton of rose hips here. This cave is all about. Stone Shell Cave. I think it's too foggy to map it, so. Actually, yeah. So there's nothing in here, but this is a great place to start a fire and cook up a little bit of moose. That's what I'm thinking. So yeah. Alright, first things first. Let's get rid of this heavy ass moose hide. <laughs> there's really nothing that needs repairing, right? I just don't want to lose this ear wrap. And then we'll read a little bit of... Not sure why I feel so tired. Just to take advantage of the daylight, you know? Oh, that was so close. And now the wind's gonna pick up. Okay, so we have to get... Bunch of stuff off of us. So we're gonna light up the stone shelf cave. We'll have to map it in the morning. Yes, yeah, so we're going to light a fire and cook up everything we can, repair any clothing that needs to be done, but I don't think it does. And we'll take off in the morning. Hopefully, the wolves will be gone. If not, we're gonna have to shoot them. So it was good to see you guys. I'll see you in the next one. And as always, peace.